Good morning! It is time for Monday Morning Motivation, Raw Stars. My name is Tiffany Roth, and I am here to motivate you to be your best every day in every way. We get to elevate. We get to elevate, right? So I just finished an amazing workout on the Tiffany Roth Fit Club. All right, I'm sorry, on the Tiffany Roth YouTube channel, so you guys check it out. It's called the Top Half. That's right, it's called the Top Half, and that's how you just work out everything from the bottom up, baby. Okay, so listen, you guys. So I woke up this morning thinking about Monday, right? Oh my God, so like yesterday, this is a true story. I was like, man, I wish on Monday I could just do nothing. Cause the weekend is like the weekend. I really just take Sundays off, right? But the weekend is like for weekend stuff, right? And then Monday is the stuff that you feel like you have to do, right? You have to do it. And so most of the time we don't want to do it. If it's a have to, you don't want to. Do you guys feel me? If you have to do something all the time, then your body resists it as something that's not fun, right? So I started thinking, you know what? I just wanna like goof off and not do anything on Monday, right? Whoa, okay. So then what would happen if I did that, right? If I did that, then I wouldn't show up for you guys. I would miss appointments. My kids wouldn't make it to school, right? All these things would go not as planned, right? So then I thought, okay, so how do I turn this around? How do you turn your Monday around? Because what I realized is some people go to every single Monday dreading it. They're like, oh God, it's Monday. And then every Friday, they're so excited. Well, what is that all about, right? Why do we have our life divided into Monday through Friday and the weekend? Hello, how about we celebrate every day like it's a weekend? Hey, right? So, this is the thing. On Monday, I decided not to just throw all caution to the wind and not meet my obligations, right? Because that's what I felt like doing. I was like, I'm not gonna work out. I'm not gonna take kids to school. I'm not gonna do any of that. Have, do you guys feel me? Has that ever happened? I don't wanna answer emails. I don't wanna do anything that I'm supposed to do. All right, so listen. When you don't wanna do anything that you're supposed to do, then what are you gonna do, right? What are you gonna do? What is the opposite of not doing what you're supposed to do? Are you just laying in bed? Are you watching TV all day, getting other people's ideas in your head, right? What is the alternative, right? So usually, what we are doing is what we chose. Oh my God. At one point in your life, you chose this. Right? You chose your Monday. You chose your job. You chose your family. You chose your mate. You chose all of that stuff, right? And if you chose it, why are you resisting it right now? Like, like somebody did something to you, right? It's like somebody did something to you because you have to go to work on Monday. What? What? Nobody's doing anything to you. You chose it, right? So, as we step into our freedom of choice, right? As we step into our freedom of choice, this is what we get to do, people. Raw stars, are you with me, right? We get to choose joy, right? We get to choose joy. So every Monday when you wake up and you go, oh no, I don't wanna do that, you remember, this is your choice, right? This is your choice. You want to eat, you wanna pay your bills, you wanna get in your car, so you go to work and you appreciate it and you find joy in every single moment, okay? Find joy in every single moment so whenever you whatever you focus on expands you guys you know I say that right whatever you focus on expands so your life your life your Monday is a choice and I encourage you to find a celebration in every day don't like chunk your life up from Monday to Friday and Friday you're free free to do what free to do what? Like, what do you really do, right? Let's keep it real. Lay down, like eat the food you're not supposed to eat. You know, just watch TV all day. Come on, stay in the bed, keep it real. Life is for the living, you guys. Life is for the living and you get to choose life every single day. And how do you do that? How do you do that? Create new experiences. So this is what I want you to do. If you're at work, I want you to reach out to somebody that you haven't talked to today. Reach out to somebody you haven't talked to, right? If you're working out, right, I want you to share your workout with a friend. Say, hey, let's do this together, right? Right, okay. If you are 
um, taking your kids to school, right? Drive a different route. Go a different way to school. Why does your life have to be the same every single day? That's what we dread. We dread the monotony. Monday through Friday. You know when I talk to people and they say, ooh, I'm so happy it's Friday. I'm like, really? Really? As an entrepreneur, right, every day is every day, right? But when people are waiting for Friday, it's like, well, then what did you feel the whole week? How did you feel the whole week? Ooh, he sent me some stars. Thank you. Was that Pushkal? What did you do the whole week? So I'm going to tell you right now, I'm going to challenge you guys to make this week matter. Make this week matter. Make this week exciting. Make this week different than every other week. Make this week your choice. Make this week the ability to choose joy, to choose joy for yourself, right? And what does that look like? Whatever you want, because guess what? When nobody's forcing you to do something, when you have some choice on how you wanna live your life, it's more fun, right? It's more fun. So, sometimes you can't throw caution to the wind and just say, screw it. And these are the things I don't want you to say screw it to. Don't say screw it to your workout because that makes you better. Don't say screw it to your healthy eating because that makes you better. Say screw it to the things that don't serve you. Say screw it to your negative attitude, right? Say screw it to your Debbie Downer attitude. <laughs> say screw it to the believing that everything is not possible, that every, some people are holding you back, right? I want you to choose joy and choose possibility. Every moment, every moment is a chance for you to create something new in your life with your thoughts, right? So you can wake up on Monday morning and say, hey, I'm alive. Let's go Monday. Let's go. What am I going to create differently if I weren't here? What, what can you, how can you make a difference today? How can you make a difference in your own life and somebody else's? That changes the scope, it changes the landscape of your Monday, right? How can you make a difference in your life and in somebody else's life? I challenge you guys to do that. And when you do it, tag me. I wanna know, how are you gonna make a difference? Because guess what? I almost didn't wake up this morning. I almost just said, screw it. I'm gonna pretend like today is Saturday and whatever happens, happens. I almost told my kids not to go to school. Then what would happen? You can do that sometimes, right? But not during finals, right? So anyway, find the joy in every single moment, you guys. Celebrate Monday as if, as if it's Friday. Because guess what? One time in your life, you chose this Monday. You chose your job. You chose your friends. You chose your family. You chose your kids. So celebrate that choice as if it means something to you. Celebrate that choice if it means something to you. Because when you have gratitude for the things that you have, when you have gratitude for the things that you have, then abundance rains down upon you. So happy Monday, you guys. Let's choose joy. I love you guys. Have an incredible day. Bye.